what is going on she barmy this your boy random marks coming with a quick video and on this video guys we're gonna be talking about an update that lucy actually posted um about shabarium she says she got the information directly from um from him so before i get into it guys like always if you're new to the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button love to hear you guys thoughts and opinion about shabarium so to get right into it guys we're gonna discuss the main man himself warren buffett about a quote that he made he said by periodically investing in an index fund the know nothing investor can actually outperform most investment professionals so typically this is what i typically see the people who dollar cost average as far as into good asset i'm not talking about no meme coin or something that doesn't have like true utility um, i'm talking about like top assets because this statement his quote could be applied to you know apple it could be applied to uh, meta it could be applied to any asset that is legitimate and it's good so in my opinion bone is that so this is why i continue to dollar cost average in um so bone currently right now sitting at 88 cents and you guys may be tired of hearing me saying this i am waiting for that 80 cents the 70 cents mark now if it gets even further than that of course i am gonna still pile in some more because i do see the value in this asset going forward so what is this update so Lucy posted on her Twitter. She says, I see the question of when Shabarium will be released. As we move through beta testing, it all depend on progress and audits. Shaitoshi informed me that there will be audits. Now, guys, I don't know if you guys seen that FUD that was going around uh, saying that, oh, Shaitoshi's not going to... Um, um, he's not going to get an audit for Shabarium, blah, blah, blah. You know, uh, Shabarium is going to be a scam. <laughs> like, I see so many FUD that just circulate. I guess because I'm online uh, a lot of time. Um, and I see, like, different people or different uh, groups or different tweets that's going around about Shabarium. Um, and it all started from, like, Shabarium's not real. Shabarium's not going to be released. The beta sucks. Like, this is the type of stuff that I see online that now, you know, people are saying like, there's going to, there's not going to be an audit. Um, but through Lucy, it looks like it is confirmed that there is going to be an audit, which in my opinion is good. And it also will, if it's done correctly or done, like it was done last time with she was swap and how there was this big excitement going throughout the whole community and people were just waiting for Shiba Swap audit to come out from Certic, then that would be a massive way to get eyeballs and people to be able to talk about Shibarium if they do it the same way um, as they did Shiba Swap. So glad to see that, you know, to dispel that flood of there's not going to be an audit. So she continued on and says, in addition, um, it is extremely important not to underestimate safety crash tests are extremely important as a long-term investor like most people in this space i feel like um or at least into bone they're looking for a quick come up um which you know it if you're looking for a quick come up that's you I mean to me that's uh you know you're limiting the amount of gains that you could potentially make especially in 2023 like i always say this 2023 is the year of accumulation of the top assets that you're looking uh to get because once the bull market starts those prices that you could have gotten in that they're going to be long gone so that's just my two cents on that but she said as long as uh as long as a long-term investor i'm sure this should be your priority for people looking for a pump like i just mentioned I'm sorry, but this is not how the price is pumped. Even after release, it could take months to fully establish itself in the market. Please rethink your investment strategy. 
Uh, pump, uh, pump crowd is more like uh, Pepe crowd. <laughs> so she took a shot at the people in Pepe. Um, but she said, uh, she bone leash is aiming for growth and generational wealth. Like sustainability in crypto is very big. The assets that typically do the well uh do well is the one that you know works in the background. Now, one of the YouTubers that I remember back in maybe 2017, 2018, and this guy, um, I think his name is Superman. Um, but this guy consistently through a bear market kept talking about cardano guys like when i mean he kept talking i'm talking about when cardano and i remember it cardano was down to like under 10 cents uh somewhere you know even gotten like the five cents three cents like he was still constantly talking like hey the pump of cardano is gonna come they're building this they're building that you gotta wait till the bull uh bull market you know by then you know, after a while, I started watching this. I was like, yo, this asset ain't doing diddly squat. So I end up stopped watching this channel. And regrettably, you know, had I just used his experience because he's been in, he was in a crypto space before me. So when he made his channel, he was talking about events that happened back in, you know, 2015, 2014, stuff like that. Um, so he saw the market, he saw the cycles. So he was saying like, Hey, keep dollar cost averaging in Cardano was at like four cents. Like I, um, I, I didn't bother buying it because I just saw the price was just constantly going down. And of course the bull market comes, you know, he accumulated <laughs> probably for, you know, a year or two at the lower prices on Cardano. And of course, once the price, you know, bull market came, it exploded. He cashed out and made a lot of money. So I say all that to say this bone is in the same phase, guys. Same exact phase. We have products that's uh, going to be released exclusively um, for bone. So while price may seem like, you know, it's just constantly going down. But for me, these are just accumulation phase. And I'm looking, I'm looking forward to these different levels, like the 80 cents, the 70 cents. Those are some levels I'm eyeing. And if it gets even further, like the 50 cents, because that's even 50 cents is also a support area as well. If it get down to 50 cents and that's more than merrier. So I thought I'd make this video for you guys, just giving you guys a little bit of an update and definitely keep your mind right. I'm seeing like, uh, the way that the sentiment of bone is starting to shift and the people who whose mindset, you know, is not ready. Hey, they're going to end up missing out. So, but yeah, leave a comment down below. Love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinion about bone. This is random arts guy signing off. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Peace.